Y'all, so today I'm doing a, my bed. Today I'm doing a chit chat, get ready with me. So I'm gonna be doing my makeup, cause I wanna take some pictures anyways. So I'm doing my makeup, and I'm about to install my wig. So I'm gonna go ahead and go down. And I'm gonna come talk after I start doing my makeup. So the products I'm using, okay. Using all of this. Hold on, my nails are busted, and my skin. I've been breaking out because I've been eating chocolate lately. So this is what I'm using. Where is it? I already sprayed my whole hold. I already sprayed this hold. I don't really use this one like that. So doing two ponytails. Just in case if my ponytails are a little thin. I already straightened some bundles out to add on. These are 20 inch bundles in the frontal. On his wig is a 20 inch. Yeah, I'm gonna take this because it's hard to buy. <clears throat> so I'm gonna use Erica, then I'm gonna use Old Hope for the second layer, and then back to Erica. Now I'm gonna know which color for this. So I got to dig in there. I don't think you're supposed to be mixing your glues like this. I don't do this with my client. I do this with myself. Let's get that clear. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and lay, like, put the wig on off camera. And I'm gonna go ahead and straighten it off camera though. But, okay, y'all. I know I look crazy. <coughs> And I got two elastic videos on my Looks like it pulled on my face. So let's talk about my new aesthetic. So, my new aesthetic. Not dark, like, I'm starting to like black again. So, I'm changing my room. I'm not gonna I'm laying where I am when we recording it. Like, the only thing I changed so far is my curtain is black. And I went to Target today to go get the white book show that's only $35 to put right in. It was gone. So now I gotta wait. So now I gotta wait. But my color theme is black and white. It pops the silver. Black, white, gray, the main color. It pops the silver. And hopefully green. But if I can't get no green, that'd be okay. Yeah, it don't take no effort to do this one. I wish it was like that with like this. Okay, I'm going to clean that up. Try to make sure if there's some light heat in there. But, yeah, I'm going to change my new aesthetic. That will be my new aesthetic. Also, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to find the aesthetic that I want to give with editing so, it may have worked I need to figure that out cause um I don't like the way some of my videos I really wanna fucking go on and change up my editing like I wanna I gotta get that I edit on I just wanna change the aesthetic I'm taking this. Fit me. Concealer. I'm doing that right. That's too much. Yeah, so that's what I want to do. <coughs> okay, my next topic. Is... <coughs> oh, goodness. <coughs> What's up, my
just brush through his head. So I think I got social anxiety, but I don't know. Like sometimes I don't know what I could do. I could be real social. This is my music. I could be real social, but at times I don't want to. And it might be because of my mood. I don't know y'all. Like for instance, one day I could go in the store by myself easily. But one day I don't want to. Do. Okay, I'm gonna do talk quiet because this video is not about to flop. This is like my third time recording. Okay, I just look, I just took the Power Grip Primer by Elf. I heard this is a good dupe for um the milk primer because I'm not spending thirty six dollars on it. Does this fit me? I'm having poor this foundation, but if I had a dewy one, I would use that one because I don't like my makeup being matched like this. I'm gonna put some foundation on it. Yeah, so I think I got social anxiety, but I don't know. It's weird. One day I do, one day I do. I think I, I think I'm in shade. I don't know. But I don't do that much. I don't do my forehead, you know, I don't do my chin. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. Okay, for my face, I'm still afraid. Oh, and I don't do none of my nose. I don't do none of that. I don't know why. I just don't. I like. Um, y'all, I'm not tempted to fool. Face, but I don't got the patience for that. So, a lot of spots I ain't glued down, and that's okay. I'm going down everything that ain't glued down. That didn't get glued down. I know, right? There's a lot of white spots. There's a lot of white spots, but it's okay. How I feel about turning 18. So I just turned 18 on July 22nd. I'm using the Andy's hot comb to take some oil. I will take the serum, but I'm still in the middle of doing my makeup. A little bit. <clears throat> so, how I feel about turning 18? I feel like at 18, you gotta the stereotype is for 18 of my point of view. What I think you gotta be out your mama's by 18. You gotta have a child while you're 18. You gotta be on your own at 18. It's not the case. If I still live my mother's house, I'm taking that same person like my eyebrows. I'm dead, dead, dead. I don't need my hair to be super bright. You gotta have an adult mentality, not me. I've been having an adult mentality since middle school. Sixth grade. I'm a very independent person. Very independent. I had to transfer a video real quick because it's giving real bright on camera. I know my eyes are going up, but that's because of the elastic being in. I know this top is a little short, but once I get, I'm gonna start elaborating myself more. But I, I don't know how to right now, and that's okay. Because I'm not a talkative person. What I learned in my 18 years of life. Take red flags seriously. Okay girl. 
but boy, take them seriously. Real serious. Don't force anyone to be there to, for you. If they want to, if they want to be there, they'll be there. If they don't need them, that's a red flag. That means you should keep your distance from them. Don't cut them off completely unless you want to. But keep your distance from them. You don't want to be around people like that. <clears throat> Cause you want somebody that can lend their shoulder when you need it, especially if you're going through it. My uh, least. Never ever that's fair to fix my little part. So let's go ahead and fix it now. Cause we gotta go ahead and do this hairstyle. So, um, this is what we're looking at right now. Pigeon two black TV. So we gotta go ahead and do that. I don't know how much hair I want to put in them. I don't know. I know I want to do a part, but this isn't a real, a real, this isn't a full principle. I'm not getting it. I'm going to just put this in a place too. I messed that one. See, it stopped right there. So, not to finesse it. And yeah, so, right here, we're going to go in here. Yeah, for sure, I'm going to add some bundles to these ponytails. I know that flow effect. I hope the way I just work. I'm about to go find a backup pair of pockets again. I don't like it. I'm going to do this right here. And that's her Instagram, y'all. I'm going to divide this. Okay, I just wrote you something to email and if you also just my own I'm gonna do a better one. But next time I'll probably do a video like this. I'll probably get some curly hair. It's stressing me out. So I'm taking this so I can go ahead and get curl my edges. Let's try. 
I'm not gonna spray it when I do see these things in clean. I got a trick. I love Bobby Penny. Hello. Hello. Alright y'all. I don't know how I'm gonna attach this. Maybe. No. Maybe like this. Feel thicker and they blend it good. So I'm gonna take a little bit of it here. You know, sorry. I'm gonna talk to y'all later. I'll see y'all in the next video.